Hey, welcome back to another episode of John's Crypto Therapy. Today, we're going to talk about Bitcoin. And of course, we're going to start it off with OMI, our beautiful OMI token that we're looking for. And we wanted to see price at a key level of structure in the high end numbers. But of course, as price has came down and Bitcoin has crashed over time, we knew that this opportunity to downside was going to happen. A lot of people have overbought or oversold. A lot of people have invested so much at the early stage. And now they're wondering, is this price even going to go up? But me and my team have been and taking a lot of profits during the way and this is what profits can do profits can make you a lot of gains and now we're going to double our bags by buying it at a very low price are we looking to buy right now yes you could buy at least five percent but i'm not looking to buy more than 25 to 30 percent reasons why there is such key evidence that price could still continue to the downside and if it does break these levels of 0 0.0014 then i'm going to look for another buying level of five percent i'm not looking to buy as much as i can right now because if prices do fall a little bit lower I know I get the better opportunity of getting more and this is the beautiful thing about this token There's so much opportunities for price to go down and if it does go a little bit lower We can lock in more profits. So overall the idea is still simple We have these beautiful zones that we drew out We have this cup and handle this inverted cup and handle We've seen the key break and I showed you guys an example of what price is going to do We're looking for price to go a little bit lower So this is one thing that you do learn in my course and I want to show you guys and share this with you and this key information I'm going to be showing you a little strategy that we use in my trading program that i do teach so this is going to be lovely if you guys do like these type of contents once again please make sure to like share and subscribe so a lot of people are wondering hey john can we have gotten into a selling pressure here and if we did get into a beautiful sell here i did not get into that trade the right way guys there's a reason why price reversed first of all there could be a divergence there could be rsi and all of those fun stuff but you don't need indicators to define to us why this level was like that first of all even though we drew this level in like this this cannot be the true level when price do break what we need to do as an advanced traders not just retail traders guys advanced traders first of all we need to look at bitcoin because if bitcoin is at a key level or a flat spot and we do see a reversal for bitcoin going to the upside what do you think is going to correlate with price a lot of altcoins that don't have backbones they're going to follow bitcoin as well so if bitcoin continues to go down we're going to see a beautiful downwards move for omi as well or other altcoins that we are interested in so the cool thing is when you are looking at this we're looking at why price did reverse here and i want to show you how cool this is first off is first we take a horizontal line we go all the way towards the bottom of the wicks keep in mind guys it's not just a horizontal line this always is going to be a zone and i do teach this in my private lessons right here so a zone it could be covered in a bigger space so that means it won't just be the bottom of the wicks the reasons why we're using this wick guys is to give us confirmation is there price on the left hand side to show us there was resistance or support if prices come from the bottom all the way towards the top that's going to be acting as resistance and once again if prices come from the top all the way down that's going to be acting as support so right here this is a support case scenario why price went back to the upside overall we're going to look left of structure to see if this level does make sense so when we look left of structure what do we see this was just a zone that we drew in to take some profits so if you are looking to enter a selling opportunity this is what we need to see we need to defeat the purpose by seeing a break below these numbers of 0 0.0013 so because we did not see a break of purpose and we did not see a retest this is why we did not enter any selling opportunities keep in mind guys if you go back towards my drawing as well to show you guys what do we draw out right here and if i take this zone right here and go towards my right hand side you can see it did break out i did project it's going to go lower we don't know the exact level but we know it's going to be in this round so if it did bounce off of the zone great but guess what it bounced off at the very bottom even though it bounced at the very bottom what do we want price to do we want a price to go all the way back up that's why i initially put this in saying we wanted to see some kind of retest of support prices to go back up to give us confirmation then guess what we will get that corrective dump and that's what we're looking for right here guys this is the exact move that we're seeing right in front of our face in a little different way guys picture perfect trading is not going to be perfect but it's about adjusting your criteria adjusting yourself and how to enter trades and how to exit trades so the reasons why this pumped and i want to show you why and this is the most beautiful thing and this is going to give you that confidence to become a great trader yourself this is a key level as we know it as support so now if i go to bitcoin real quick let's take a look at that right here when we go to bitcoin what happened with price over here so price came back to a key level and it found that key level of support and we did have a beautiful divergence as well so when we 
take a look at this divergence guys we're gonna go from the bottom right here all the way to the downside you can see price is going lower while on the rsi how cool is this we always try to explain this the price is going higher so there you go guys we have a bullish divergence this bullish divergence was only going to show me one thing and one thing only that price was trying to scale to the upside where is it gonna go it's gonna go maybe to retest this as resistance and if that's the case omi can go a little bit higher if omi goes a little bit higher then we can see the deep retracement and this will be the beautiful sell-off that we're looking for and if this does happen for omi and we do see prices consolidating on the top then we can see bitcoin going lower then guess what that's going to be the beautiful dump that we're looking for to pack in more omi tokens at the very bottom the cool thing is guys i want to go back to the daily real quick and this is the most beautiful thing a lot of people are focusing on this little diagram that i drew out but it's not about that guys the overall picture and the overall sentiment should be the bigger diagram that we have right in front of us the bigger diagram guys is going to be a huge bear flag this bear flag goes all the way to the downside and i always mention this to everyone that knows how i trade when we look for the fibonacci retracements we want to see a 50 percent retracement for a flag 50 percent retracement is one of the key levels of reversals to show us a strong move to the downside or a strong move to the upside but that's a bull flag this is a bear flag so that means we want to see a retracement to the 50 and that's going to give us a good push to the downside as you can see price is breaking towards the downside we have a clear break of this beautiful trend line right here guys and that's why price is consolidating for a little while before we could go a little bit lower does it mean it could go lower now no it could go all the way back up once again towards this trend line then it could push back down or consolidate for a little bit longer then we can see price going back down so for my bitcoin analysis or price prediction or the bottoming out of bitcoin i want to take this extension and i want to say roughly right here guys so what i'm looking for the lows of lows for my bitcoin price this cycle is going to be maybe you know what it's going to be a range of ten thousand dollars to close to maybe six thousand seven thousand dollars so maybe six thousand five hundred dollars roughly around that range okay guys so i'm looking for this little pocket so when prices come back towards this pocket what i'm going to be doing is really looking to you know accumulate more bitcoin because i think this is going to be a key level looking left of structure these are the zones that we draw now and take a look at this what did price do around these range what was price doing it was just consolidating for this little while so that means that price is going to do the same thing what we can attend to do is wait for price to break these key levels then enter our beautiful buys or sells so for that reason alone we can see why this makes sense because there's a lot of key reversal points exactly at this trend line or the zone that we just drew in and you guys can see how important this zone is so that means x is going to mark the spot so that is what i'm looking for for the final move or at least the bottoming out of bitcoin does it mean it cannot go lower or it cannot stop a little bit before absolutely guys it could do that but overall i think this is such a great way of looking at bitcoin the cool thing is we did have another flag before this and i'm going to show you where it played off right here guys and when we look at the other flag right here when i put it in you guys will see a clear picture of what i'm talking about so this was the other flag this is the extension and the pull take that to the breakout and look at how cool that is it exactly fell towards the bottom of the other flag or the continuation of a new flag formation so it kind of gives us a clarification that bitcoin has been playing off of this channel or this flag formation that has been happening throughout the sequence and the cool thing guys once again take a look at this and i want to show you how shocking this is guys patterns in this type of markets repeat itself and if you do not believe me take a look at this i've called this as much as i can i showed a lot of information and showed you guys where price is going and look at exactly where this is going towards the x marks the spot so i wouldn't mind prices going a little bit lower and for that reason do you think personally do you think omi let's go back into the omi chart do you think omi is going to hold off from not breaking a little bit lower i think this could actually be another push to the downside so personally for me if i am buying any kind of omi it's only going to be five percent five percent is still a big amount especially when i'm playing with big money so if i am you and if i was in your shoes use this as learning opportunities for better entries and better understandings for your own trading criteria so right here we do see prices going up but i do believe that bitcoin does fall all the way towards the downside 
we can see Omi going a little bit lower. But of course, before we do see Omi going a little bit lower, I do want to see a key break of 0.00122. If I do see a key break of 122, I am going to be releasing a special video and showing you guys how low Omi can truly go. But this is not an end all video for Omi. Omi is going to bounce back. I truly do believe it. And all the weak hands and the people that are selling and not realizing the true value of Omi, I really do appreciate you guys because you guys are going to give me the opportunity to load up on my Omi token. I believe Omi is such a great value project and it's truly going to explode. So what I'm going to be doing, if Bitcoin is going to continue to downside, we have a future projection for Bitcoin to be in the range of $10,000 to $6,500. And that is a good range. If that is the case, do you really believe Omi is going to hold above these levels? I don't think so. But if it does, that's great and that's awesome. For that reason alone, I do believe Omi is going to fall a little bit lower and maybe even dramatically. We're going to lock in as much Omi token as we can and we're going to try to pile it up. And if you guys do like this video and you want to see the next video on where I truly do believe Omi could go, please make sure to like, share, and subscribe. Other than that, thank you so much. Take it easy and John out. Peace.